Perhaps the greatest memory came on Christmas morning a year and a half ago. Santa brought Christian a metal detector and Calvin had scattered a bunch of coins throughout the yard. It's the quintessential holiday moment. The whole family outside together, Calvin vicariously enjoying this new toy through his son's excitement, Melissa recording the entire thing on her phone. But suddenly, the metal detector hit something where no coins had been thrown. Did you put it there? I didn't put anything here. It's a box. Whoa. What the? What is it? What the? Oh my god. No, are you serious? We were the treasure digging, but I already found my treasure. Oh. What I found you in Kansas City. Will you marry me? Yes. He'd been planning that moment for quite some time. He helped design the ring, selecting the curvature of the band, the size and placement of the diamonds. He found the box at work and placed additional metal items inside to make sure that they found it. <laughs> he scouted just the right place in the yard in front of a large tree, and then he buried it. Then he checked the calendar and realized that it was about a month and a half until Christmas. So every day before work, he'd walk by that spot and tap it with his foot to make sure it was still there. Now the truth is he'd been thinking about this for even longer than that. Calvin, today I choose you to be my husband, my best friend, and my partner in life for the rest of my days. I vow to show up in this marriage each day new with a grateful heart to do the work it takes to keep our relationship happy and healthy. I vow to cherish you and the time we have together, knowing that we do not complete, but complement each other. I feel like everything in my life has led me to you. My choices, my heartbreaks, my regrets, my everything. When I'm with you, all my life's worries melt away. Today, I commit myself to you. I vow to honor you with all my actions and love you with all my heart. I vow that you won't only see my love for you, but that you will feel it. You want me to? Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> How'd it go? <sighs> Good. Did you like the letter? I love it. <laughs> the reasons I feel in love with you are simple. You are such a beautiful person inside and out. And how you treat Keeks and Kiko to helping me raise Christian. I knew you were the one when you met Christian and immediately loved him and treated him like he was your own. It has been a rainy Memorial Day weekend. We kind of lucked out today. I don't know if anyone has been paying the forecast as much as I have, but it's pretty similar to that first Memorial Day weekend where Calvin and Melissa met three years ago. We had all camped out at Melvern Lake in central Kansas, and we were hoping for sunny days, warm waters, and cold beers. Well, it turned out just, in fact, everything was cold that weekend. Sometimes when you have the best made plans, it storms. About this time last year, my husband Thomas and I were at my parents' house and we were just hanging out, eating dinner, loving on Russell, it was a normal night. My dad looked at my mom and said, honey, we are so lucky. Look at these beautiful, healthy, happy kids. My hope for you is that years from now, you're sitting at your kitchen table or doing something that was so completely ordinary and you're still saying things like that to each other. Over the course of these good times, I learned a lot about Calvin. I learned what a dedicated father and family man he is. I learned what about his passions for travels, to learn new skills and pastimes, and unfortunately the Seahawks. 
I am lucky to have him as a friend. When I met Melissa through my wife Casey, I found she shared a lot of the same values that I admired in Calvin, and I know that Calvin noticed the same. I'm so happy to stand here today to celebrate your wedding and spending the rest of your lives with your best friends. Congratulations, and never forget to find the fun in the storm. And that should be your goal going forward, to maintain that passion and thoughtfulness toward one another, to continue to nourish and grow the love and the family that you already have, to keep traveling, to keep surprising each other, and to keep creating new memories together.